Friends, on today's video, I'm gonna show you how to detach audio or separate the audio from your clips here in iMovie. It's actually really easy. Let's do it right now. Okay, so as you can see, I'm working on a quick little tutorial video here, and I thought it'd be great just to show you how to detach your audio in case you wanted the audio piece of your file separate from the visuals. Now, there's a lot of different creative things you can do so all I'm gonna do is show you how to do it and then I'll let you kind of take it from there. Now there's two ways of actually doing this. The first is if you've already imported your clip and as you can see, we've got the clip up top here and then obviously the blue indicates our audio and the different levels and the peaks and the lows as you can see by these little graphs. So what we wanna do is we wanna actually come over to this clip and I wanna detach the audio so that I can manipulate it on its own. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make sure that it's highlighted here in yellow. And then I'm just going to secondary click. For me, it's a double tap on my Mac trackpad. This might be your right click on your mouse. Uh, once I do that, we have a few things that pop up, including this detach audio option. Uh, you can see that here's a little keyboard shortcut if you wanna use that on your Mac. I'm just gonna click on this and watch what happens. You can see that the audio is now separated from the clip. I can grab it and I can actually move this around now anywhere I want. You can see that you've got this little green line indicator that will let you know that's where it is attached to visually on that clip. Now there's one other way of doing this and that's actually to grab your clip and drag it down in. And instead of dragging it to your main timeline, come down here and drag it to the audio section down here. You can see the visuals on my clip automatically went away and it's just automatically going to import just the audio portion. You can also take this and stick it down here into the music section as you can see down on the very bottom. In this way it'll drag in the clip without the visuals even attached to it. So again, a really simple way of doing this. I hope that helps make things easier. If it does, hit that thumbs up button. Let's just know we're making helpful videos and stay tuned because we're making a bunch more iMovie tutorials and those are going to be released really soon. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you again on the next one.